Hey guys, so today I'm going to be uh, reviewing right now my whole entire Sonic the Hedgehog movie collection. So, yeah, I don't not uh, I don't have like the whole entire uh movie set. So, yeah. So, I'm just going to review everything that I have right now. So, yeah. I hope there's, like, merchandise for, like, the third movie because that's what I'm, like, hoping for the most because it would be cool to see, like, movie shadow with plushies and, like, figures and stuff, you know? So, yeah, um, we're gonna go from merchandise from the first movie to merchandise from the second movie. So, yeah, let's get started. So, uh, first is, um, is what I got recently. I made a review on him, like, a few videos ago so um it's the toy factory uh movie sonic um movie sonic plush so yeah he he's pretty fuzzy he he's kind of like a, a little sparkly and stuff he has he has like random like laced up shoes and stuff with that's not the classic shoes so yeah uh, he has the, the one eye, and he doesn't really have that much detail on the ears, but he's pretty soft. So, yeah, I, I like this plush. He's, like, uh, the best Sonic, uh, movie, um, actually, no, he's the second, uh, best Sonic movie plush, in my opinion. Uh, so, yeah, he's, he looks pretty cool. Uh, as you can see, he's, like, sparkling and stuff, and that's the back. It's, yeah, any stuff. He still has his touch tag. Pretty cool. So, uh, yep. Next one is, uh, it's one of my favorites. It's the, uh, Talking Sonic plush. So, um, it, it's, like, 13 inches and stuff, and it so still have the red, basic, lazed up shoes and stuff. He has, like, random printed on fur. Uh, it looks alright, I guess. It it says, like, a, a bunch of voice lines and stuff, so, like... So, do you guys want to watch a movie, or what? Alright, high five! Gotta go fast! Is that all you got? Takes more than that to stop me. So, yeah. Um, the face is alright. I, uh, the mount kind of throws me off. Looks like he 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 he's just holding a lemon in his mouth. I don't know why they gave him that, but all right. That's the back. He has some kind of like uh, voice box where you can like give him like sound effects and stuff. So yeah. Uh. So yeah, that's pretty cool. Not gonna lie. Um. Next up is is the is the baby Sonic plush. So, um, so, um, uh, well, he's based off the old design. That's basically all I gotta say. Um, he has no, oh, shoot, I dropped him. Uh, so he has no boots or shoes. It's just, uh, his feet, bare feet and stuff. Still hasn't doesn't have his gloves because of course it's based off the old design and stuff so yeah and uh he has like for his uh for his back spikes there's like uh flaps of like uh, uh, uh what what material is this uh i, I don't know the, for the tail it's just some short thingy and there's like there's the spikes stuff there's the ears, there's like, uh, some, uh, tan flesh, or like, I don't know, peach colored triangle and, and stuff, and yeah, the face, it's kind of cute, I guess, it's, uh, you got the small eyes and the random mouth and stuff, yeah, pretty weird, so, um, lastly for the first movie, uh, we have the baby Sonic keychain. Um, this originally, this originally, uh, released in Japan. Um, but not much sold, so they, they, uh, they made it as a freebie for 
when you buy Sonic Colors Ultimate. So, yeah, that's where I got it from. So, yeah, he's pretty cute. That's the back. Uh, he, he, uh, I just noticed he is missing, um, one of his spikes. It's supposed to be, one of them is supposed to be in the bottom, so. Yeah, that's, uh, it's kind of strange. The face, I like, I love this face, bro. Like, uh, hold up, focus. Focus, man. Uh, maybe the back up, maybe. There you go. So his face, it's a little cartoony, but also pretty cute. Uh, he has gloves, so that's good. Uh, and he has the, the white, uh, I mean, no, the peach colored belly and stuff. And, uh, for some reason, they still depicted him without boots or shoes. So, yeah, that's kind of disappointing. I don't really like that. So, yeah, and he, he has this thing, yeah, it says Sonic the Hedgehog, all that stuff, you know. So, yeah, that's all I have for the first movie. I didn't really get that much because, I don't know, they didn't really make a lot of merchandise for the for the first movie. So, yeah. So, yeah, that's all I have. Now, let's move on to the second movie. Okay, so the first, uh, so the first piece of merchandise... Um, for the second movie that I'm going to review is the whole entire Sonic the Hedgehog 2 McDonald's Happy Meal set. So, I already made a review on this one. Uh, so, uh, they, we have, uh, two Sonics, two Tails, two Knuckles, uh, the Deck Deck Robot, and Super Sonic. My, my, my favorite being Super Sonic. Because, uh, for some reason, he's just the fastest in the set. And, uh, yeah, so, um, as you can see, um, if I grab the Snowboarding Tails, he includes stickers, which I personally do not like. Because, uh, it, it just peels off, gets all weird and stuff, you know. It's just, it's just, I don't know, they could have just, like, printed it, printed, like, decals or, like, or, like, I don't know, paint them. I mean, yeah. Yeah, I don't really like how they put stickers, but it is what it is. It, the, in my opinion, the, the moles are pretty cool, not gonna lie. So, uh, yeah, that's the McDonald's Happy Meal set. Next up is the Tornado Biplane by Jack Specific. So, uh... Uh, Knuckles wasn't included in the set, I just added him there for fun. So, uh, yeah. It is pretty cool. It's a Walmart exclusive, so you can't get this, like, at Target or, like, anywhere, really. So, yeah, um, it has, like, uh, spinning propellers and stuff, so, yeah, that's a cool feature. It has a pretty good, uh, shade of red. Uh... And, um, and there's, like, wheels in the bottom and stuff. And there's, like, cool-looking stickers, like, on the top. So, uh, yeah, and it comes with a standard Sonic, and there's, and there's a 2.5-inch figure of Tails with his, uh, flying cap or whatever you call it. Uh, so, yeah, I, I, I like this. I like this set. Uh, there's, like, pegs on the top and stuff. So you can, like, uh, stick, like, a bunch of 2.5-inch figures on the top. Uh, so, yep. That's the biplane. Okay, so next up is the 2.5-inch figure movie set. So, uh, you got the Buzz Bomber, Robotnik, Sonic, Knuckles, and Tails. So, um... My personal favorite is either Sonic or Knuckles because Knuckles, Knuckles' design is pretty cool, but Sonic's design is more accurate to the movie. Um. So, yeah. Uh, Tails. Um, I'm not really a big fan of his. Uh, um. Of his 
uh, what do you call it, uh, his, his headpiece, because, uh, I don't know, it's something about his mouth and his eyes, it kind of looks off, uh, I don't know why, and the Buzz Bomber, it, I don't really like it, because it, it's, like, not even detailed, like, at all, I, I wish they could have, like, gave it, like, a more silver looking paint texture on, on the Buzz Bomber. And I, and I really like how they uh, detailed ro Robotnik so much because it's pretty more, it, it, it's more detailed for, for uh, a figure that small. So, yep, yeah, pretty cool. Next up is the Sonic the Hedgehog 2 wallet. Yeah, wallet. Uh, so, um, in the front, I really like the drawing of Sonic, uh, in his movie design, um, he's, like, waving, he, he's, like, waving his, uh, his finger, just, like, in, uh, in the, in most of the renders of Sonic that you see, most likely the, uh, first game, so, yeah, and he's, like, in, and he's, like, in the, in some kind of ring, so, yeah, pretty good drawing, in the back, um, it's, it's a running drawing, Sonic, which looks like something from Sonic 06, got a bunch of rings, and there's, like, arrows and stuff, and, uh, there's the logo, and, uh, when you open this, uh, it says, gotta go faster, 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 Sonic the Hedgehog 2, so, uh, yeah, and, uh, there's nothing really, there's nothing else in, in the other side, so, yep, I got this from Target, pretty neat, not gonna lie. Next up is the Death Egg Robot, or Giant Eggman Robot playset. You can find this at Macy's and Target. Uh, I got this one from Macy's because, um, you couldn't really find it at, like, a physical store in, like, Target, but now you can. Uh, so, uh, the Death Egg Robot is randomly painted purple. I don't know why. It actually looks pretty menacing, not gonna lie. And, uh, it has, like, articulated arms, which is pretty cool. It also comes with a bridge, uh, for some reason. It's, like, from the near, n near ending of the movie. And, uh, yeah, the movie is almost out. I, I, I mean, the movie is almost... Uh, away from theaters, so I'm pretty sure spoiler isn't really a thing you have to worry about anymore. So, Supersonic, yeah! So, um, here is Supersonic, the first movie Sonic, su uh, uh, that is super. Um, for some reason, they made his eyes green, and for season for series two of of the four inch figures um they're making another supersonic and uh hopefully they fix that because uh yeah and if we look at the back he's missing a spike so that's weird uh he's made out of rubber uh so you can like hit him and stuff so uh basically the the, the gimmick is to like knock this guy uh uh he you're supposed to knock out the Death Egg Robot, but it doesn't work. So, uh, this game, or this playset, is pretty cheap. Except for the price, though. I don't really recommend it. If you want a Super Sonic figure, uh, you can get this one. If you, if you want to like a bigger one, you can, uh, get the Super Sonic movie figure that's coming out soon. So, yeah. Okay, so the next one is the 4-inch figure of movie sonic i really like this figure actually he is pretty well detailed he has an accurate mold and uh and face and uh and the shoes are pretty well detailed it looks like the exact same from the movie i like his sculpt to be honest um randomly they gave him like this random pointy thing like in the side of his belly uh, i don't know why but yeah and uh 
he has pretty good hands and yeah the paint job on this is pretty cool to be honest and uh that's the back of his head and the back of his body and he also includes with a skateboard i i, I should know what do you call it i don't know what to call it because it's not a skateboard because it doesn't have wheels on it i don't know but it's cool so yep it's my uh oh wait, never mind. ah shoot i dropped him so uh yeah even his soles are pretty pretty uh detailed i like it uh so yeah that's the four inch figure next up is uh is the three pack of sonic movie outfits or variants so we got baseball sonic that never appeared in the movie party sonic which uh is in one of my favorite scenes and siberian sonic or what they call it snow sonic for some reason why did they name it snow sonic it should be called like winter sonic or like siberian sonic i don't know so uh yep uh my favorite might be the siberian sonic because he just looks so cute in that outfit i don't know why uh party sonic is pretty cool uh yeah i like the gold paint on his chain and uh baseball sonic uh i don't really know uh i mean it's okay it just looks kind of basic I don't know. So yeah, that's the three. Uh, uh, that's the three. Uh, pack of Sonic movie variants. So yeah. Okay. Uh, next up we have the the Sonic the Hedgehog Speed RC. So uh, he's pretty cool actually. He's uh, he's pretty big. Not gonna lie, he's a little heavy. He has, like, these rubber uh, wheels and stuff. And he has a cool sculpt. And it's also articulated, so... Yeah, that's cool. And uh, he also comes with a remote. And uh, it, it, it's a ring. So, uh... So, um... Uh, this button is for him to, like, turn. This one is for him to, like, uh, uh, go really, really fast. And uh, this one is for the light. So yeah, um, you should check out my review on this guy. He's pretty cool. Uh, I do like him a lot. He he is like one of my favorite Sonic Two, uh, Sonic Two merchandise. Uh, so yeah, pretty cool sculpt. This is the back. Uh, seven head spikes and three back spikes and a tail. Yep. And I like how, how how they made him, like, his socks are kind of showing. So, uh, yeah, I like that. I like that detail. So, uh, yep. And no, he's not riding on a bad nick. He's riding on that random uh, snowboarding uh, thingy uh, that, like, he rides in the movie. So, yeah. Pretty cool. Okay, so next up is the 9-inch pl uh, plush set of the main characters. So we got Tails, Sonic, and Knuckles. So, uh, for, I'm, I made a review on these, so I'm gonna keep, I'm gonna make this kind of brief. Tails, pretty cute. Uh, I don't like how they didn't really give them, like, a proper nose. It's just, like, flat. Pretty cool shoes, uh, his... Tails are put together. I don't know why, but they should have made it separate. Sonic, pretty cool. Uh, they didn't really give him much detail on the shoes, really. His his face is pretty cool. Uh, uh, his um, his back is is pretty accurate, except he's missing a back spike here. So yeah, pretty cool. And uh, Knuckles, my favorite in this set. Uh, because of how derpy he looks, he has a, his mouth is like pushed in like mm, real good, and uh, and uh, he has a 
little nose and the uh, weird looking eyes uh cool looking shoes and uh he has a he has his big old tail and stuff so uh yeah also by the way uh um i got the box too so yeah at the you know plushies in the side of course and uh yep that's the the that's the nine inch plush set so yeah next up is the uh 13 inch uh sonic movie plush uh he he is one of he he is the best sonic movie plush out there because he he looks very fuzzy and he is he his shoes are very well detailed bro and uh he has like plastic eyes which i really like and uh cool hands kind of basic but pretty cool that's his back still missing uh one of his back spikes there his tail and uh yeah uh, also, his tag looks pretty cool. And, uh... Yeah. He has a pretty cool nose. And I like how his mouth is, like... Kind of, like... It's, like... Uh, I don't know how to explain it. It's, like, kind of pushed in. To make, like, like a proper mouth. So, uh, yeah. And his ears are pretty cool, too. So, uh, yeah, my favorite Sonic movie plush, in my opinion. And lastly, um, I have the Sonic the Hedgehog 2 Build-A-Bears. So we have Sonic and Tails. They made a Knuckles one, but his like an online exclusive, and I didn't get a chance to get him. So, yeah. So, uh, Sonic, he's pretty cool. Uh, although he doesn't really look like his, uh, movie counterpart. So, yeah. It's pretty soft, too. So, yeah. And, uh... Tails is pretty accurate. He looks like a mix of his, like... Of his, like, game counterpart and his movie counterpart. Pretty cool. And, uh... His tails are, like, kind of flat. But they're at least separated. And, uh... His shoes are pretty sparkly. Or... Not sparkly. Kind of shiny. Pretty cool. And he, he has the Sonic Movie 2 logo on his soles. And, uh, for Sonic, um, he has, uh, these plastic-looking shoes. And, uh, yeah, you have to buy them separately. And, uh, if you, if you take off his shoes, you get a, you get a, a weird, a weird look of his socks. And, uh, he has the Sonic 2 logo on it. So, uh. So, yeah, this is definitely an upgrade to the first Sonic movie, Build-A-Bear, because, uh, it looks pretty questionable. So, uh, yeah. Uh, the Knuckles one looks pretty cool, but I don't own him. So, yeah. Okay, guys, so that was the full, my full, Sonic the Hedgehog, uh, movie merchandise. So, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Please like, subscribe, hit the bell notifications, and you can share this video if you want. And I'll see you guys in the next one or video. Bye-bye.